Those visiting the savanna of the Serengeti in the May dry season will see an unforgettable sight. There is a dark wave spreading through the green savanna. It is a grand parade of 1.5 million news. The news are migrating to the north. This 1,000 kilometer journey involves deadly risks and unavoidable deaths. This great migration has been repeated for 2.5 million years and it is the most significant drama nature can create. Why have they been migrating for so long? There is only one reason animals hurry in this savanna. They are looking for food. Elephants have to move more often, as the gluttons usually spend 16 hours eating 180 kilograms of food a day. Grass covers the vast savanna but it disappears as 2.5 million grass-eating animals pass by. In the dry season, 1.5 million news searching for water and fresh grass begin to migrate. This long journey begins in the savanna of Serengeti, Tanzania, and it continues for four months until they reach Masai Mara, Kenya. Unwelcome companions also join in the journey. They are the meat eaters that prey on news. If news lower their guard even for a moment, they will instantly turn into a lion's feast. A new looks like a slow animal, but it has excellent senses of sight and smell typical of grass-eating animals, and they run fast. But these abilities don't always keep them out of danger. This new ran into a shrewd hunter, and it died a tragic death before beginning the journey. The lion is smacking its lips with the tenderest of the new's meat. The scorching sun is the enemy of all the animals. The dry season in the savanna is without a drop of rain. Puddles dried up, grasses are losing moisture. The zebra is continuously bathing in the dust to protect its skin from the hot sun. The savanna is burning without a bit of shade, but news keep marching forward silently, enduring the intense heat as hot as 95 degrees Fahrenheit. Right now, there is only one thing that all animals hope for, water. Elephants, which drink about 200 liters of water a day. The king of all beasts, lions. Nothing can survive without water. The Grometi River in the northern end of the Serengeti. This is the largest source of water in the northern savanna. After two months, the news arrived at the Grometi River. 
the sound of news wailing in thirst. The Nile crocodiles in this river notice that it's time. The news ran and ran for days without drinking a drop of water. The smell of water is making them more impatient, but a sip of water can end their life. Elder experienced news are careful, but the young new, just born this year, doesn't know the danger yet. The sound of sipping alerts them. The news quickly crowd into the riverside. This is the very moment crocodiles have been waiting for. The first victim, it was a helpless young new. They know hungry young crocodiles are waiting for them, but news need water. The thirst is as desperate for them as the risk to their lives. A narrow escape from death, only possible for a strong mother new. As time goes by, more crocodiles come. With eyes on the top of their heads and the nostrils facing the sky, crocodiles can stalk their game very closely without being discovered. And when it catches a new, it drags it into the water to drown it. When the new dies, a savage carnival begins. Crocodiles bite the new and twist their bodies to tear off the new's flesh and bone. In a moment, the new is torn into pieces as the crocodiles continue to fight each other to have more meat. A crocodile has as many as 66 sharp teeth, but they are only good for biting. They can't chew well, and they swallow the entire bite of meat whole. The tail, which makes up about 40% of its body, is the source of its strength. They use the strength when they turn around, burst from the water, or catch a fish. The biggest one in the pack is the leader, and it always takes the best part, the head.
But not all of the crocodiles have had enough. The crocodiles have waited for this moment all year round, surviving on little fish, and they are not easily satisfied. They take another youngling. Facing the deaths of their kin right before their eyes, news step back in fear. But patience doesn't last long because of the thirst. A fairly large new is caught by its ankle. Crocodiles pull their game into the water to drown the game. The new fights back, but is dragged into the water. In a minute or two, it will drown to death. This is Techno Canon CX and this is my quality selfie. Technocam on CX's 16 megapixel front camera with dual soft light flash and beauty enhancement and show off your quality selfie. The carcass of another new floating nearby stokes terror in its heart. But no matter how hard it struggles, it can't free itself from the crocodile. The crocodile is trying to drag the new into the water again. The new will lose more power in the deep water. The crocodile is the smartest and most patient animal among large reptiles. Using all the strength left in it, the new steps on the ground with its foreleg. On the ground, the new has an advantage. The crossroads of life and death. It's a desperateness that can't be shared with anyone else. Its companions give up hope. They begin to leave one after another. The new begins to fight back more desperately, but it only makes it worse. When the new loses its balance, the crocodile gains the upper hand. The new is being dragged further into the water. The time to give up its life is drawing near.
But at the last moment, the crocodile becomes exhausted and gives up. It was a life or death struggle for 30 minutes. Sometimes the instinct to survive is stronger than any power in the world. It is quiet again as if nothing happened. This peace will not be broken for one year until news come back. After eating their fill, crocodiles cool down by opening up their mouths to let out their body heat. Crocodiles are the oldest living reptile with 65 million years of history. They will survive on fish and birds until next year. They can survive a year by eating only half their weight. Hippos can be found anywhere there is a river, lake, swamp, or water in the Serengeti. Hippos live in groups, and as many as 100 hippos live together in a place near water during the dry season. Hippos are known for the size of their mouths, but they are better known as great divers. They can stay underwater for as long as five minutes. Hippos spend much time in the water to prevent their skin from drying up from the scorching sunlight. This one blows its smell in the faces of others. It's protesting that they are in its territory. Hippos are very exact about their territory. Two Tommies step into the territory not knowing about the territorial division and a hippo attacks one of them immediately. The other Tommy is also attacked. The intruders are killed. Hippos will attack anything that steps into their territory, whether a lion or a man, but they are peace-loving animals that usually feed only on grass. News migration paths include a region covered with dense forest. Taking a good rest under the cool shade of trees, it is the joy of the journey that they haven't had for a long time. After a quick break, news begin to move again. They move up to 16 kilometers a day. The news move in a group of hundreds or thousands, and this parade extends up to 40 kilometers sometimes. In the northwest, a region covered with dense forest, there are many animals that are hardly found in this savanna, like the giraffe that eats thorny acacia leaves by rolling its long tongue to tear them.
The giraffe's neck is about two meters long, but it has only seven bones, just like humans. With a long neck and a long tongue that it can extend 50 centimeters, giraffes can easily get to leaves other animals can hardly reach. Baboons also live in the acacia forest, like giraffes, and they are busy eating up fruit of sausage trees. Young baboons live on their mother's milk until they are eight months old. Young baboons begin to ride on their mother's backs in a unique way as early as six weeks after their birth. Another animal that loves trees is the savanna monkey. It's easy to find savanna monkeys picking lice from each other's hair all around the Serengeti. They are the most common monkeys in East Africa. The mongoose is a type of animal that lives in the rocky areas around the savanna. In the bush, beside the rock, a rock hyrax is enjoying a meal. A mongoose family and the rock hyraxes are living in groups around this rock. A rock hyrax raises its younglings in the crack of a rock and feeds on bushes and leaves. The younglings love to take a sun bath on their mother's back. There are many different natural environments, such as rocks, grass, and trees, and over 500 different species in the Serengeti. begin their journey in groups of hundreds and they join other groups on the way, forming a huge group of thousands and millions which cover the savanna in black. It's been four months since they started their journey north. They reach the Mara River in the borderland between Tanzania and Kenya. The place on the opposite side of the river is their final destination. But for the news, there is a huge barrier. It's the 30 meter wide Mara River. They need to cross it to get to their final destination. The dark wave of news quickly crowds the riverside. The sound of the rough stream discourages them, but they can't give up now after the long journey. The leader steps forward. It estimates the current and the breadth of the river. While the leading party is held back in front of the river, more news keep coming into the riverside. The leader braces itself again and tries to find the narrowest spot of the river.
Finally, the leader makes a decision, but is discouraged as soon as the cold water hits its jaw. The herd seems to wait for the leader to jump into the water. Bilioni 32 za faida ya kutumia Mpesa kutolewa kwa wateja wa Mpesa. Tuma ujumbe wenye neno kiasi kwenda 153000. Utapata ujumbe utakao kufahamisha gawio lako utakalowekewa kwenye akaunti ya Mpesa ndani ya siku 45. Sasa unaweza kufurahia gawio lako la kutumia Mpesa. Nunua bando mara zote na Mpesa. Piga nyota 150 nyota 00 alama ya reli. Vodacom Power to you. After trying for a third time, the leader begins to swim. Following their leader, all of the news begin to rush into the water. Following the instinct handed down in their blood for the last 2.5 million years, the news challenged the rough stream. Thousands of news crossing the river through rough waves are one of the greatest spectacles on earth. They continue to march forward using all of the strength they have in fear they can drift away at any moment if they run out of energy. There are already some victims. There are also some news that lose courage and go back. But those who march forward to the end will be rewarded for the fruits of their labor. The battleground is covered with carcasses. Another new has crossed the death line dramatically. The other side of the river is just a step away, but they still have to fight the fast current. It's shallow, but the current is so fast that they can drift away if they miss their step. The young news seems utterly exhausted. It's desperate to get out and is fighting hard, but it's only sinking deeper into the river. All around the river, vultures, the scavengers of the savanna, are excited to have a feast. To the Long Mara River, new herds of news are arriving all along the river. This place is even more dangerous. And they need more courage
the crocodiles have been looking for a chance to begin hunting. A new is caught by a crocodile, but many other news are able to cross the river because of its sacrifice. Thousands of news have crossed the river safely with the sacrifice of just a few news. And there are some news returning from the leading herd. They lost their family while crossing the river. Mothers that have lost their younglings are worried. Younglings look for their mother. Mothers and younglings are frantically looking around to find their families among newly arriving news. There is nothing that stops this grand march. They would run down a precipice as deep as five meters without hesitation. A young new missed its step while jumping down the cliff. The mother comes back looking for her youngling through the slope beside the precipice. The mother and the child are left alone here. If they don't hurry and join the herd on the other side of the river, they can become prey to beasts. Crossing the river alone takes much more courage. The mother hesitates but begins to lead the way. crocodile attacks the mother. To make things worse, the river begins to swell with the passing rain. But for some reason, the crocodile gives up in the middle of the struggle. The new has survived by the skin of its teeth, but the leg bitten by the crocodile is completely broken. The pain is extreme, and that it could bring about shock, but the mother continues to move forward to the herd. The only thing in her mind is her youngling. is getting further away from her. But the pain and despair become a mortal wound for the mother.
just before the promised land, the mother had to abandon its journey. Finally, the final destination of the journey is in sight. It was such a long and tough journey. A new world with newly grown grass is just a few steps away. To come to this land, they have traveled for many hours risking their lives. The news will stay here for a month, enjoying fresh grass, and return to the savanna of the Serengeti. one and a half million news and a quarter of a million zebras leave, the savanna of the Serengeti falls into calmness. After all the news leave, the Serengeti National Park Service sets a fire in the savanna. Each year, when the savanna dries up, large fires break out naturally, and the Park Service burns only grasses to protect the trees. After burning the grasses, harmful insects such as mosquitoes and flies will disappear, and new grass will grow faster. The wilds of the Serengeti have been preserved with the help of these delicate efforts. The savanna of the Serengeti and the Ngorongoro crater were originally the Maasai tribe's territory. Ngorongoro is a huge crater that is about 30 kilometers square large. It is surrounded with a 600 meter tall cliff. A number of wild animals are preserved, so it is called the department store of animals. As one of the most invaluable resources for the human race, the value of its preservation was recognized. So the place was designated as a nature preservation area in the early 1950s. Following that, the park authorities moved the Maasai tribe that lived inside the crater to outside of it. Maasai culture involves the custom of warriors hunting lion to prove their bravery. Today, lion hunting is prohibited, but their custom still remains a ritual. The warriors leading the hunting party jump as high Hey, Coca-Cola? bahati kweli. Hii ni happy hour. <laughs> Na umejishindia Coca-Cola ya bure. Lakini lazima uinywe. Hapa hapa.
as they can and stamp their feet before the hunting. This is to threaten the lions. A long time ago, the Maasai had to fight with nature in order to survive, but now they are learning how to live within nature. Periodically, they educate the Maasai about the preservation of nature in the Ngorogoro preservation area. Because they can't maintain the natural environment without the help of the people who actually live with animals. When the dry season begins, the Serengeti National Park's managers are busy. Because of the increasing number of poaching, poachers hunt news that begin to migrate and other beasts that move along with the news. The park authority monitors poaching using a variety of means available. The surveillance plane flies over the savanna to look for poachers. When they find poachers, they contact the main office and rangers are dispatched immediately. All rangers must be armed, because it's very dangerous to deal with poachers that use various weapons. The sweeping of poachers is close to a military operation. It's difficult to catch poachers who are organized and use various methods the leader found a trap. Poachers set a snare made of wood, wire, and tree bark. They are trying to catch the animals coming to eat leaves or grasses. Finally, poachers are in sight. In the Serengeti, the struggle between poachers and watchmen, the chased and the chaser continues. There are three poachers, and all of them live nearby. Poachers set up a hideout in the savanna and stay there for a while to prepare the meat of poached animals and skin and dry up the animal's skin. They poach because of poverty. Uh, the kind of poaching which is done in Tanzania is for food. They mainly go into the bush, hunt those animals, just mainly, I said, for food. You can see people like those, they, they look poor. The confiscated skins are burned on the spot to prevent them from being introduced to the black market. But no matter how much effort they put in, poaching is difficult to eradicate. To those who are desperate for a meal, the survival of themselves comes before the survival of animals. A quarter of the territory is designated as a nature protection area in Tanzania and they have been emphasizing the importance of animal protection nationwide. The park frequently invites young students to the savanna for an on-the-spot learning experience. Children can watch wild animals and learn the ecology and how to protect them. Children who learn about and understand nature will grow into people who love nature even after they grow up. <laughs>
animals lived here before the human history began millions of years ago, and they will continue to live here. The Serengeti. It is the greatest heritage that nature has given to the human race. Baada ya kutoa mjengo wa kisasa kwa msomaji wa magazeti pendwa kutoka mkoa ni Iringa Global Publishers mwaka 2017 inakuja tena na shinda nyumba ambapo wasomaji wa magazeti ya Wazi Ijumaa Champion Risasi Amani na Ijumaa Weekend wataondoka na zawadi kibao za mamilioni kila mwezi na mwisho wa shindano lazima msomaji mwingine kujishindia nyumba mpya na ya kisasa kutoka Global Publishers ili kushinda zawadi kem kem kila mwezi na kujiwekea nafasi kubwa kushinda nyumba hakikisha unanunua magazeti ya wazi Ijumaa Champion Risasi Amani na Ijumaa Weekend kila siku ili kujua jinsi ya kushiriki kwa kusoma magazeti pendwa ya Global Publishers kushinda mamilioni kila mwezi na mjengo wa kisasa Global Publishers inakutoa kimaisha 2017 shinda nyumba